friends, welcome back to our channel. Today we're going to make a Bombay style dish. Today's Bombay style dish is going to be Siv Puri. Siv Puri is a super simple, easy snack dish to make and it's my favorite street food dish whenever we go to Bombay. So let's look at our ingredients. So here we have these flat puris, or just like flat, like little puris. And then for our sauces, our chutneys, here we have this tamarind date chutney. And this tamarind date chutney is made out of de-seeded dates. And then they add, you add some tamarind, some jaggery, and then you want to cook it on low heat for ten, eight to 10 minutes. And then afterwards you'll add spices like chili powder, dried ginger powder, and salt. So this other chutney here we have is coriander mint chutney. This one, the ingredients you'll need is just coriander, mint, green chilies, lemon, and a little salt. And both of these, the detailed like list description of it will be in the description box below. So here for our other ingredients, here we have some sieve for garnishing. And then we have some boiled potato and later we're gonna add some chopped masala and some rock salt to the boiled potato. And then for our vegetables, we just have onion and tomato. Now don't be shy to add too many sieve because it's healthy, so you can add more. So here we have our boiled potatoes. We took it out and crushed it. And now we're going to add some rock salt. Now you can use normal salt, but we're using rock salt for, rock salt for this video. And now we have some chopped masala. Just going to sprinkle some. Okay, now we're going to mix it. And give it a light mix. And then when it's mixed nicely, it'll like taste good in the sieve for you. There, and now it mix, it's mixed nicely. So now we're going to add it on the sieve. So now the assembly process is very easy. So now we're gonna start the assembly. Basically what we're gonna do is we're first gonna add some boiled potato on sieves, on the puris. And then we'll add some onion and tomato. Then we'll put our chutneys and then we'll put a lot of sieve. Don't be shy with the amount of sieve because sieve always tastes nice and adds a nice like crunchiness. So now let's start the assembly.
Okay, so now the sieve puris are ready and we're just gonna sprinkle a little coriander leaves on top. Okay, and now it's ready to try. It tastes really good and it's nice and like crispy and you get all the flavors from the chutney and the vegetables and you guys should definitely try this out. Now don't forget to like this video and subscribe to our channel.